Hello, 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 Earthly Virgos. This is Nikki here today. I hope that today has been good to you. I want to get started. If you're new to the channel, welcome to our family. All right. So Virgo, what do you need to unconsciously uh, deal with? Okay. What is unconsciously bothering you? Message for Virgo. What is your unconscious trying to tell you? The Seven of Swords. Seven of Swords, okay. Something's bothering you and you really don't know about it. We have the Page of Pentacles. Um, and something that you're, you're needing to look into. And we have the Six of Pentacles here. Six of Pentacles. So uh, it feels like there's some sort of energy around you that you really can't trust. Maybe you can't trust a certain person or a particular situation. What is unconsciously bothering Virgo? The Ten of Swords. We have the Seven of Cups. What is unconsciously bothering Virgo? And we have the Three of Wands. Okay. Overall energy. What is unconsciously bothering Virgo? Um, Queen of Cups. Uh, followed by the Ace of Cups, Virgo. Okay. So it, it looks like there's something that I don't know. I, it's, I don't know if some of y'all have had an issue to where you had to report someone for, ch for child abuse or doing something ch to children that they shouldn't be doing. You maybe witness somebody treating their, their children wrong or something like that or um, having a house that wasn't clean to have children in it and you felt the need to um, say something. Maybe this person was on drugs or selling drugs outside of the home or something like that. We got the Ten of Swords, we got the Seven of Swords. So it's like you really couldn't trust this person. You saw this person going through some stuff. You could have also witnessed a crime here and you wanted, wanted to know what choice, will have, what choice do I have. Children are involved in this, so I got to say something. I got to, I have to report this. So it's like there's some sort of something that you need to report. Maybe you've seen something unconsciously. Your unconscious is telling you, listen, pay attention to what's going on next door. It could be, you could be hearing things. You could be hearing somebody get abused, maybe a spousal abuse or child abuse or child neglect or something. But it's something that you're seeing or something that you saw and your unconscious is trying to tell you something, Virgo. You're peeping something out, but you're really not paying attention to your intuition because you really don't know what's going on. But it's something going on around you that you need to pay attention to. Because if, if you reach out, if you pay attention, it's going to help those children. It's going to help that battered woman. It's going to help whoever it is that is getting hurt or harmed in some in some kind of I mean, in some kind of capacity. Something's not right here. Okay. And um we got the um the death card. Uh, you know, you could probably be preventing someone from really getting hurt here. Okay. Maybe you witnessed a death. Maybe you witnessed something, but you really, um, you saw something happen like at the end of the moment. Next thing you know, they're down on the ground. You know what happened? I turned my head for a second and this person is gone. Okay. But you saw it, <laughs> you know, because you were paying attention, but you weren't paying attention. It's like one thing happened and next thing you know, boom. Okay. Virgo, what is your unconscious trying to tell you? The, the Three of Swords. Okay, what is Virgo's unconscious trying to tell him? The Five of Pentacles. Maybe walking away from a job. Maybe this is the opportunity that you're, the, the answer that you're seeking. Should I leave my job? Possibly. Okay. Um, we got the world for it. Okay, there's something better for you, Virgo. Okay, another job, uh, another destination for you. So this may be an opportunity for you to really, really pay attention to what your unconsciousness, what you're dreaming about, uh, what your higher self, your intuition is telling you. You're, it's like you're getting messages, you're getting downloads, you're getting hints. You're getting led someplace else in your life, Virgo. 
page of swords. See, I believe somebody's keeping their eye on you or you are keeping your eye on somebody. All right. The three of Cups. Wow. I, I don't know, Virgo. I just feel the Eight of Swords. I kind of got a feeling that, that you witnessed something when it came to children. A, 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 a woman taking care of the children or, or somebody around some children. And you're wondering, like, how is she going to treat those children? She better not be doing them to treat those children wrong or whatever the situation is. Somebody's watching. Somebody's watching somebody doing something and not saying anything, not reporting it. Okay. You're just, maybe you don't want to get involved. Maybe these, this is, maybe you live in an area that there's crime and you see something or you heard something, but you don't want to report it. Okay. What do they say? Snitches get stitches, that kind of stuff. So I don't know where though. This, this is kind of a little dark i know okay we got the nine of pentacles followed by the page of pentacles is still watching and we got the three of pentacles oh the tower something that works is gonna happen for you virgo well something that works is gonna happen maybe happening towards you or somebody else we got the boss watching the boss is not watching the boss has other people like like minions watching the other staff members and all of a sudden something's gonna happen something's gonna go down okay because you're being watched or the people you work with are being watched virgo so you know what kind of pay attention Got the high priestess here okay uh, there could be some witchcraft as well somebody possibly trying to put a spell on you and, and causing you to lose out on on work and opportunities the magician yeah somebody's putting a spell on you we got the will of fortune and somebody could also be putting a spell on you or maybe you could be doing some some spells on uh, making more money and income like that for your finances and stuff to get better possibly with work okay but there's some witchcraft going on around you too virgo so kind of watch that you may have a hater who's trying to take your job or get you fired or, or or something like that but two it could backfire on this person they get fired and you get the promotion so definitely keep out there because we have the tower and we have the high priestess as well as the magician this has witchcraft written all over it okay so kind of watch it be careful with uh, somebody at work who may be doing something, casting spells or, or um, doing some things that could really, really mess you up, mess you over, that kind of stuff. You don't want that kind of energy. You don't want the negativity. Playing games with your feeling. This person may have two-tone hair color, okay? Maybe bald. You know, uh, maybe uh, this person possibly wears a lot of black. So kind of watch out for that. Virgo, what is your unconscious trying to tell you? When you give, you also receive being resistant to change in extremes on how you save or spend money. So kind of watch out with how you spend money. What spectrum are you on? Do you spend too much or do you save too much? Okay. I mean, really, I can't even shuffle without, without cars wanting to fall out. Okay. Your insights, they come from quiet meditation, the need for more sleep, and it's time for to go off. So it's, maybe your job is, is stressful right now. Spirit wants you to, to kind of like take a break because you're probably having issues sleeping. Maybe you need to take a few days off to get a break. Uh, I'm hearing get solitude for yourself. What is your unconscious trying to tell you, Virgo? It's time to take action. Great passion for a cause. Instinctively knowing what what you want to do. You all and you all instinctively know in your life what it is that you want to do, but you're not moving. We had that um, the Eight of Swords card earlier. You're just sitting there. You, you know you can move forward. You know you can make this decision, but something has you stagnant. Okay. Maybe it's fear. Maybe you don't want to get involved if, if you're around people who are hurting each other. You hear things, you see things, you look one way, you look the other way, and then next thing somebody dropped, okay, or something like that, okay? You didn't actually see it, but you were there, all right? Hmm. Your worry is unnecessary, Virgo. Focus your thoughts on the outcome you desire. Release feelings of regret, guilt, or worry to the angels, Okay. Some things you can't change. Some things are inevitable. 
but you can't let that bother you and bog you down. You got to move forward, okay? And this is too for people who you are concerned for. If they're going through some things or if you're watching someone harm their kids or their significant other, maybe you should speak up, even if you do it anonymously. Okay. Hopefully, if it's if it's if well, if it's happening to you, hopefully someone will do the same thing for you. Okay. What is your unconscious trying to tell you, Virgo? It's time for a celebration, abundant rewards, and for your hard work. Okay. Release yourself from burdensome situations because your life is about to get so much better for you. Things in your life. It's time to celebrate the promotion, the job offer, a new job, you know, for some of you all. Moving movement forward to new homes, for marriage, to be locked down with somebody who uh, you're going to um, live the rest of your life with. Just stay open to the changes that are coming to your life. And hopefully you will help someone who needs to be helped further. Okay. Let's get a final message. Very long. Shapeshifter. Okay, things in your life are changing, but you have to be open. Allow yourself to receive this change. And we have a, an adventure. Life is, an, life is an adventure. You don't have to take things so serious. Your doors are about to open for you, Virgo. But are you going to walk through them? All right. So this message resonates. Thank you again for your support. And I'll be back in a little while.